Hey everybody, it's me. Um, just getting on here to talk, really. So, you know, we had this incident go on that, you know, people got upset, people got hurt, some people's feelings got hurt. And I'm not going to get into the incident, but I am the type of person <clears throat> that, you know, I'm not always 100% the best person. I say mean things. I do mean things. My moods change. Um, and I always have these walls up. But that's definitely for a different story. But that's just how my life has always been. That I can remember. But I'm also the type of person that I love to help people. And I care for about people way too much a lot of times. And I give people so many chances. It's not funny. More than they ever deserve. If I meet a criminal, I try to see the best in them. I want to save everybody, I guess. I want to help everybody if I can. But I'm also the type of person that I see and feel people's pain. And I've always been like that. It's not just pain. I feel the tension from people. It could be, you know, somebody just hurt them. It could be that they're sad inside. It could be so many different things. And I, and then, but then I always take the blame for it. And it's not even to do with me. Um, you know, I sit here and I hurt. And I'm sad. And I'm trying to figure out how to fix their problems for them. And. Even if that person's not near me, I can feel the tension a lot of times, depending on how well or how much I've been around you. And, you know, the incident that happened here was a total accident, um, you know, but I think um, people think it wasn't, and also that I was okay with it, I'm not sure. Um, but I kind of get blamed for it, um, you know, so, but on top of that, like, I can feel the tension, I can feel the, um, the pain that the other person's feeling, I can feel, you know, um, like, I can tell they're, you know, even blaming me without even saying it, um, but it's not just with that. I mean, it's with so many different things. And who you know, or who I know, or who I'm around. Like, I can feel their sadness. I can feel their loneliness. I can feel their, like, and, but it brings me down to feel all that. I don't think everybody's like that. I don't know. Um, does it make me human? Maybe. Does it make me someone with a good heart who really understands people's feelings because, that's kind of been my life, maybe, you know, I don't know, um, you know, I'm one of those people who, they always say, you can put it out there, but you can't take it, and that's true with me, I can be pretty mean, and, um, but if people do it back to me, I, I can't handle it, um, I'm an emotional person anyway, so, uh, doesn't really help, you know, um, you know, again, this person puts it out there quite often, but couldn't handle an accident, um, and again, I think wants to blame somebody else instead of holding, I mean, don't hang on to a grudge, you know, <clears throat> it just brings your life misery, and you know, <clears throat> I have these walls put up. Only certain people have been able to get through. 
And I'm one that I try not to hold a grudge the rest of my life. Anyways, um, I just wondered if anyone else was like that, where you can feel people's pain or loneliness or, um, tension, uh, you know, that you don't even have to ask questions about it because you can only feel what it is. It's difficult to live with, so it definitely brings me down more. Anyways, talk to you guys later. Bye.